Drive Vote has just updated, so let's check it out. And for the first car in this update, we have the Razor UTE Evo, which I think is just a better Saxon. And we also have a Condor. And in this update, we have a revamp to the challenge system. You can earn gold from challenges, which I think those are the ones that stay forever. The Condor is a dealership car. There's a new race called Waterfall Pass. And I guess we'll check this out. And if you head over here, you can see that the Spring Rally event has ended. And hopefully you were able to get the spot you wanted on the leaderboard. And if you head into the quest tabs, you can see that they have completely changed the challenges tab. So all those old ones have been removed. And as you can see, completing five out of seven of these, you'll get 85 gold. But unfortunately, you'll have to wait to unlock the rest of these. But the first one we have is skid pad figure eight. So I'm going to try and beat it. Also, they make it to where you spawn in the exact same car now. There we go, that one was actually really easy. And completing this one, you'll get $150,000. And the way you spawned in with the car from this challenge, it'll also work for the weekly challenges now. So if I go into Monument Trail Shadow Race, I'll spawn in with the bullet, which is a car the person is using. But this one is really difficult. Well, they uh, updated the game and fixed it and they added this new race. Let's try it. Wait a minute. What is this car? Wait a minute, who's that handsome guy right there? Gav Gav RB? He seems pretty cool. <laughs> I'm just watching my spawn and there's a whole bunch of micro buses flying by. And there we go, we can claim that now. And now I'll show you the 10 parts in the USA map. For the first part, head over to this trailer transport area right next to Jumping Jacks. And you'll see the part right under the bridge. For the next part, go over to this race right here, Reckless Raceway. And under the bridge over here, you'll see the part. For the next one, this is a kind of weird one. You want to go to Sawdust Sprint right over here. And if you head over here, <laughs> you'll see the part is hiding under the dirt for some reason. But you can still hit it and get the part. For the next part, head over to Waterfall right over here. And then if you head down here, you'll see the part right here. For the next part, head over to Steelworks right here. And right over here, you'll see the part. For the next part, head over to this trailer delivery spot right next to Racetrack. And right over here, you'll see the part. For the next part, head over to Gold Rush right here. And right on this ramp, you'll see the part. For the next part, head over to this food delivery spot right here. And right over here, you'll see the part. For the second to last part, head over to this trailer delivery spot right here up at Mountain Town. And right in between these park benches, you can see the part. And for the last part, head over to this food delivery spot up here as well. And right here, you'll see the part. And with that, let's complete the rest of these weekly quests so we can check out the Razor UTE Evo.
And there we go. I basically completed all the weekly quests, but I can't complete this one because you need eight daily quests and you only get five a day. So I'll need to wait till tomorrow to complete that one. And there's also not a point in completing this other one until I get those new daily quests. And here it is. And these are the customizations on it. And this is the new race we have, it's Waterfall Pass, and I'll show you this right now. This race is pretty good, actually. And then we have the brand new car, the Condor, which is 125,000. And here are the customizations on it. And with that being said, I think that's going to be the end of this video. Make sure to do this weekly challenge, and I'll see you in the next video.